If you love those motion blur artsy photographs like Kelly and I do, here's how to get it on video like this. So first thing first is if you're gonna be shooting outside like I did, you're gonna to wanna to use an ND filter. This is gonna help you properly expose your image without it looking too bright. Second thing are the record settings. I kept mine at 60 frames a second so you can still slow down the video in post. So last thing are your settings. You wanna keep your ISO as low as possible. I kept mine around 160. Your f-stop around 1.8 or as low as you can. And then your shutter is the key here. You wanna keep that around 115 to really get that motion blur. Put all that together and you got this.